Greetings! Manta Ray 79 here! And welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Card Fight Vanguard Dear Days Part 53! Alrighty then, let's begin pressing the A button now. Loading game and proceeding! And here we are in the main menu, off to story mode! And here we are, back where I last saved. For those of you who watched my previous video, I spent that time progressing further into the game's story over here in the Sakai Shrine. And now in today's video, my next objective is to do the same thing, progress further into the game's story over here in Exercise Park. So let's head on over here, selecting it here, and a fight will occur during this event. Proceed with this deck. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, and click. And off we go! And here we are, I, Rasen seems a bit sad for some reason. What? Thinking about your sister, someone is going to talk to Rasen. And Rasen is surprised, it's Doshi! How did you know? Before we talk, how about a fight first? Oh, we're being challenged by Doshi? Huh? Rasen is surprised? I haven't had a chance to fight today. Well, that's true. <laughs> and I think it'd be a good change of pace for you. Doshi! Rasen. Rasen. In this fight, I want you to show me your vanguard. Oh, the stakes are high. My vanguard? Okay, I'll try. And Rasen's all motivated. And here we are in the deck selection menu for the deck I'm going to use in this fight. It's the Stoikeia's Roroa deck, selecting deck, and the battle begins! Let's get started! And here we are in the fight. We're going to decide who goes first, so... Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Scissors to paper, I win going first. Drawing our starting hands, I got a Persona Ride, a two pieces of Lyoka, a Raffles, and a Front Trigger. Not a bad draw. Holding on to all one copy of each normal unit, redrawing the extra copy of Lyoka and the front trigger. Redraw, yes! Got Candeliria and a Raffles. My turn, draw! I ride from the right deck, awakening from Slumber Roa. For the right deck cost, I am discarding a... I have two copies of Raffles, discarding the extra copy, so discard and ride! Roa. Skill of Roa. I superior call a plant token to the back row. Here we go! One plant token! And call! That's it for my turn, and the turn, now my opponent's turn. He's riding the Great One. Nigel, skill of the starter, he draws a card, and... He calls the rear guard, Eteris, and Orlando. 8k to 8k. No guard, gonna take it. Here it comes, drive check. No trigger, so one damage to me. Ow! D skill activated! And damage check! Yeah! Draw trigger! Lucky! Draw card and all effects to Vanguard! And now, here it's the end of my opponent's turn, my turn. Stand and draw. I ride from the right deck, the world 3000 years later, Roa. For the right deck cost, I am discarding a Raffles and ride! Roa! Skill of Roa, retire one rear guard, superior call two plant tokens. And here we go, calling one and two plant tokens, superior call over here and over here. Looking good, call. Next, I call to the rear guard, drag Ritter girl flame blossoms, Radelina over here, call. And skill of Radelina, counter blast one, counter blast and Superior call one Mamake token. Here we go, one Mamake token to the rear guard. Call. Looking good, and I call to the rear guard. Hmm. Wait, I'm gonna first use Mamake token skill. Retire two rear guards, retiring, and getting 5,000 power for each retired rear guard, plus 10,000 Mamake token. Then I call. Candeliria to the rear guard, call! That should be enough, going to battle phase. First, 
Candelaria attacks the rear guard Idris. 10k to 5k. The attack goes through. And Pierce. One less rear guard to worry about. Now my Vanguard attacks the Vanguard. 10k. The attack goes through. Drive check. Alright, another draw trigger. Draw another order card. I power up my monkey token. One damage to my opponent. And slash. Damage check. No trigger, safe. Now, Mamake token attacks the Vanguard. 25k. The attack goes through. And boom. One more damage. Damage check. No trigger, safe. Idris, one less card to worry about. Now, Radelina attacks the Vanguard. Skill of Radelina. Soul Blast 1. Soul Blast. And inherit of Mamake token's power. 35k to the Vanguard. The attack goes through, and slash! One more damage! Damage check! Alright! Critical trigger! He wasted a trigger! Lucky me! Trigger effects wasted, and that's it for my turn! Now it's my opponent's turn! Wait, hold on, there's still Candelaria's skill! Self-retreat! And in her place, call two plant tokens! One and two! One and two! Call! Now it's the end of my turn! My opponent's turn! He rides the Grade 2 Randor. Skill of Nigel, he soul charges and calls a Travis and Idris to the rear guard. Alright, Vanguard, Vanguard. No guard, gonna take it. Drive check. No trigger, Idris, so one damage. Ow! Damage check. No trigger, Lioka. And now boosted by Idris, Travis attacks the Vanguard for 15k, 10k to block. Mm, I don't have enough, no guard, gonna take it. Here it comes, ow! Damage check. No trigger, ah no, inlet pulse. End of my opponent's turn, my turn, stand and draw. Ah, I drew a heal trigger, not good. Then I ride from the right deck for one's precious thing, Baroa. For the right deck cost, discarding the extra copy of Resolute Pair of Eyes. And here we go! Ride for one's precious thing, Roroa! Next, I deploy from my hand Resolute Pair of Eyes. Counterblast one and sacrifice the rear guard, sacrificing the plant token in the middle and deploying the order. And now, here comes Resolute Pair of Eyes skill. When successfully deployed, search my deck for a Radalina. Searching deck and adding Radalina to my hand. Looking good, and next I'm going to call Lioka to the rear guard. E yep, hold on, wait, no. Let's see. I think I'm going to first... Hmm, this is a tough choice, what should I do? In my drop zone, I have a bunch of cards here. A counter blast left. Okay, I know what to do. I activate the order card. Spiritual body, cotton. Oh, nope. Sorry about that. You can only activate one order a turn. I already used resolute pair of eyes. Not good, so... Okay, then. First, I'm going to... Alright, activate my Vanguard skill. Soul Blast 1, Soul Blast. Superior call up to three plant tokens. And this time I'm just gonna call two, so one and two, and call. One and two, call. Next, I activate Mamake token skill. I retire two plant tokens and power up Mamake token, 5,000 power for each retired rear guard, plus plus 10,000. And then I call to the rear guard, Lioka, call. That ought to be enough. And now going to battle phase. First, my Vanguard attacks the Vanguard, 13k. The attack goes through, Twin Drive, first check. All right, another draw trigger. I give all effects to Mamake Token. I drew a Karyophilius, second check. Yes, heal trigger. I can heal, healing one point of damage and giving power to Mamake Token. So that's one damage to the opponent. Here it comes. And stab, 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 poke, 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 pierce, and damage check. No trigger, safe. Now boosted by plant token. Lioka attacks the Vanguard, 20,000 power. 
He guards me critical. 25k attack yeah. blocked. No worries, I can still make it. And now Momake token attacks the Vanguard. 40,000 power. No, the attack goes through. And boom! <laughs> Damage check. Yes! No! Ah, uh, no, critical trigger. Ah, uh, he got trigger. Adding power to Vanguard. And alright, Radalina attacks the Vanguard. Radalina skill. Soul Blasting 1, Soul Blast, and inheriting all Pomake Token's power. That's 50k to the Vanguard. Ah, perfect guard. He had one for the perfect guard cost. He's discarding a Eateris, so the attack fails, and that's the end of my turn, my opponent's turn. He rides from the right deck, the Great 3, Heavy Artillery of Dust Storm. Eugene, skill of his grade 2, and draw, Vanguard skill, he's resting two rear guards, retiring oh, one of my plant tokens, uh oh, and power to the Vanguard, and Travis's skill, counter blast, soul charge, and ah, uh, he retired oh, the token, and power to him as well, either is his skill, counter blast, and ah, uh, he retired my rear guard, Radalina as well. And here comes the Vanguard skill, Soul Blasting, and Superior up to four cards. Two triggers and a Brachial. Brachial skill, self rest, and retire. Ah, all of my rear guards are gone. And Brachial skill, restand during battle phase, adding power. Oh, he's getting really good, good cards here, so. Alright, I'm gonna let the Vanguard go through, block Travis, so I'll just block this first attack with the draw trigger, Lena. Guard! 23k, attack blocked, and... ka -chink. Safe! Now here comes Vanguard, Eugene, 27k. No guard. Wait, hold on, Orlando skill into soul, plus another 5,000, 31k, 32k, so... Nope, still not gonna guard it, taking it. And twin drive, first check, no trigger, and second check. Ah, draw trigger, lucky, he restocked his hand and powers up Travis, one damage to me. Here comes. Ow, damage check. No trigger, no, not another inlet pulse. And skill of burning flail into soul, powering up Travis again. And now it's Travis to Vanguard, 36k. I can't block it, gonna take it. No guard. Here it comes. Ow! Damage check. Ah, critical trigger. Wasted a critical. Not good. All effects to Vanguard. And trigger effect wasted. This is getting rough. End of my opponent's turn. My turn. Stand and draw. It's time to Persona Ride. Persona Ride for one's precious Dengarowa. Here we go. Persona Ride. And then I'm going to first activate Marola's skill, Soul Blasting 1, and Superior Call up to 3 plant tokens. Here we go. 1, 2, and 3. 1, 2, and 3. Call. Then I call to the rear guard, Radalina. Call. Radalina's skill. Counter Blast 1. Counter Blast. And. Superior Call a Mamake token to the rear guard. Call! And then, Mamake token skill! Retiring up to... Let's see... I guess I'll retire three rear guards. Retiring and... Powering up Mamake token by a total of 15,000. Then I call to the rear guard. Blooming Petal Karyophilius. Call! Karyophilius' skill! Soul charge! One and two! An order card and a critical. That's fine, I guess. So, what's next? In my, I can still use the order card, spiritual body condensation. So, what can I call to the, from the rear guard? All right, I'm gonna activate spiritual body condensation. Soul blasting one, soul blast, and superior call a card from the drop zone. I am calling Lioka. To the rear guard, call! Powering up Lyoka, but that's not gonna last. Lyoka's skill, self-retreat, and... Here we go! Giving 10,000 power to one rear guard, giving it all to Mamake Token! 
And now that I think that should do it. Yep, that ought to do it. Going to battle phase. My Vanguard attacks the Vanguard, 23K. He double guards with two triggers, 38. No nope, intercepts as well. That's 43K, two to pass, first check. No trigger, perfect guard, another bad draw. Second check. Yeah, critical trigger. I give all E. Well, no, I give the critical to Mamake Token and power to Karyophilius. Critical up and power up. Looking good there. The attack may have failed, but I still got more attacks to make. Now, Mamake Token attacks the Vanguard. 35k, two crits. The tackle's through, and boom! Damage check. No trigger, six damage, I win! <sighs> well, that was a pretty okay fight. Got to draw the cards I needed to make this deck work, so I got... Win, double trigger, attack with 50,000 more power, did a Persona ride, six turns pass, did a Superior Call, and retired five or more opposing units. I got 1950 DP, total 54,975 DP. Pressing A to go next, leaving fight, returning to the game's story. Nice work, Rasen. I got a good look at your vanguard. Doshi seems satisfied. Doshi, I... After those two fights earlier, you obviously weren't acting like yourself. Yeah, it's just... I couldn't be myself. Oh, that's rough. <laughs> but you know, your vanguard was telling a different story. It was? Yep, Rasen's confused too. You can't hide your true self in a fight. Isn't that what you taught me before? And Rasen surprised. You see, I have an older brother who can do just about anything. Whoa, really? Doshi has a brother? That's surprising. <laughs> Everyone would always compare the two of us and push me to be more like him. Now that sounds pretty tough. I didn't know you had a brother. People expected me to be like my brother or blamed me when I couldn't do things like him. Well, that's harsh. And whenever that happened, it almost felt like I didn't exist. Sounds like a rough childhood. It's the same for me. Through their eyes, it might be a harmless little remark. But to us, their words, their words really are sharp knives. Does it still bother you? I'd be lying if I say it didn't, and that's not something I can change. But just like how I'm explaining this to you right now, Gosetsu-san reached out to me when I was spiraling to despair. He told me that Vanguard is a place just for me where I can be entirely myself. Another life saved by Vanguard. There are things you can't change, so you should change yourself instead. True words couldn't have been spoken. Change myself. Your sister is your sister, and you're you. Besides, that fight just now didn't lie. <laughs> Every time I watch you fight, I see your strong will shining through. Doshi! Now Rasen's all cheered up. Unlike me, you have what it takes to be a pro. Follow your heart and keep moving forward. A lot of wisdom is being passed down here. And don't give up on yourself. Right, thank you. See, Doshi? I knew you were a strong person. And the scene ends, and... We're back in the map here. Got a new card. The card we got was... Converted to CP. It is the order card. Fleeting Shine that lights life. We already have four, so it's converted to CP. And we're back in the world map. So I think with that, that's just about the time we have for today. First, I want to say is... Thank you to the viewers for watching today's video and to please stay tuned for more videos I plan to upload again in the near future. I also hope you'll show your support by liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing to my videos and channel. And with that I say, goodbye and see you all soon.